Hey y'all, Lampy here. Welcome to episode 11 of my Total War Shogunate 2 playthrough as the Shimazu. It's been a while since I recorded one of these episodes, but I believe in the last episode we had just taken the Chesokabe's capital on their home island. And things were looking pretty on the up and up for us. We were starting to, we're starting to not do so great uh, in naval combat. So our navies leave a lot to be desired, but at this point in the game, that's not too big of an issue. And our biggest naval threat is the Chesokabe at this moment. The Hojo are at war with us. We got Waco Pirates. Yeah, so our, our, our navy's in bad shape right now. That probably is the biggest concern right now, biggest thing we got to take care of. So let's just see where that is at the moment. We got this guy right here. You should probably regroup with the that ship. And we got our so we got some recruits coming out of there. We got another navy right here. That realistically can't break out of there, but it should still be recruiting ships. You need to be repaired. You're getting repaired. You are getting blockaded in. So there isn't really anything we can do about that right now. Um, how the hell did... Where did you come from? I didn't see you. Oh, we gotta send Ninja up there to stop them. Or we gotta send an uh, army up there, actually. Tana, we're at peace with them, so yeah. We might as well send this up here. And they stand no chance. We'll send a ninja up here to deal with them. Where's our other ninja we got over here? He's hanging out right here. I already used him. You can be useful in morale up here, I suppose. And then here's the important bit. Here's uh We wanna fix that castle. They already have a merchant guild, no dachi. We don't want a Yari drill yard here. We'll build a Sake Den. And we don't really need a Nodachi Dojo either. So we'll build. Other stuff. Alright, uh, diplomacy wise, let's see. Everyone doesn't really like us except for the Takeda. Takeda has a lot of their allies with the Oda and have a bunch of different enemies. Maybe make. What's the wines? Cannot ally with one of your enemies. Why does the Oda hate me so much? I never done nothing to y'all. I guess just because they're friends with the Hatano. And the Chesokabe, and I'm murdering both of those guys. Interesting arrangement so, here. Alright, but... Nothing to be worried about, though. Because the Oda does not appear to be interested in naval. So, well, don't speak too soon. Take it one thing at a time. First things first. All right, so plan of attack here. We should try to take most of this island in this turn, at least another province or two, and we gotta get our navies on track. So I think that's a good goal for us. Let's make that happen. So many clans. Well, not even, but there's just... Uh, I really do not like the naval aspect of this game. I've said it once, I'll say it a million times. I just think it's bad. <laughs> That's all I'm going to say about it. It's boring. It distracts from the main camp. It's just I find it to be a distraction. In my humble opinion. Damn it. These guys are going to be annoying, aren't they? I really gotta get off a fucking monk over here to deal with those guys. Really? 
Really? Uh, retreat. Yeah, run the fuck away, bro. Alright. Live to fight another day. We need all the boats we can get. There's no point in sacrificing them to stupid shit. Now, frig off, bro. You are so dead, bro. You are so dead. Alright, try and execute, try and execute. I've got to get a monk over here. I gotta do it, like, right now if I can. Looks like the coast is clear. So you get on this boat. You get this monk over here, like right the fuck now. All right, bet, bet that that'll help. Um, sabotage enemy building and do. Bets, 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 bets. All right, uh. This direction, there we go. All right, just to make sure they can't run away. You try sabotaging them, see what you can do. All right, no matter. Just go kill them, bro. That's really cute that you think you're gonna get away, but there's just no, uh, no escape. Alright, um, you need to be sabotaging the Chisakabes. We need to be sabotaging all the ports of these guys that we possibly can, just so they make us... The last thing we need is for them to be making more boats. Of any kind or type. That's all we can handle. No, it ain't. We're just gonna have to chew that one for a little bit. Can't realistically break out of there either. We can totally take this out though. There we go. Alright, that's something. Here, alright. We have some navies right here, which are almost good to go. This is our last good port where we can still make boats uninterrupted, so I say we take full advantage of that. Here you. You hang out. Combine forces here. Pair them up. Keep the boats moving. Keep just keep churning out the boats, guys. Keep churning out the boats. We need them so bad. You hang out here. All right, then we can get some boats made in here now. Right, and we need um, Buddhist Temple and Sake Den. And we can, can we leave and y'all would still be happy? No, we cannot. We gotta stick around here for a little bit longer. But once we use this monk to take out their Metsukes. Because the monks, the monks countered the Metsukes. So I'm not, I'm gonna, I guess I haven't explained this yet, but there's three different agents in this game. The ninjas, the, uh, always need more of you guys coming in. I'm starting to get a little pricey here. I'll explain this in a, in a little bit here. Uh, yeah. Um, so yeah, essentially there are three types of agents in this game. There are the nin ninjas, there's the monks, and there's the Metsukes, and they're sort of a rock, paper, scissors to each other. So monks are very good at countering Metsukes. They have a big advantage over them. Metsukes are really good at getting ninjas, they have a big advantage over them, and ninjas are really good at getting monks. So that's just sort of like the rotation that it goes in. So you need ninjas to take out the monks, you need monks to take out the Metsukes, and you need Metsukes to take out the monks. And on top of that, they also have the other things they can do, like the ninjas are really important for taking out a, you know, a sabotaging people's armies and things of that nature. 
Matsukes are good at uh, increasing the repression of a province. Matsukes are kind of, they're good for the economy. I hear that like if you put them in your most profitable provinces that they'll up the tax rate safely, which can be useful, I suppose. And then monks are some, depending on the clan you're playing, they vary in usefulness. Like if you're playing as an alternative religion that isn't just like the standard Buddhism of Japan, the monks are super useful because you're going to have to convert everybody as you're conquering them. And so that's going to really slow down your progress if you don't have good monks. But rig off, pirates. Alright. First thing we got to do, right out the gate, is we got to take back these ports that we lost. Gotta do it instantly. Next thing we got to do, we got to take out these guys. There we go. All right. You get back here. Uh, I really don't feel like I should be scuppering anything at this point. Yeah. That's kind of nice. So you're a fresh, clean navy. All right, you go fucking take out these guys then. All right, we got something heading that way at least. You can head back here and let's just keep churning out the ships, baby. Just keep churning them out. You're going nowhere. Uh, you. Let's free this port. Let's free him one port at a time. Is that worth knocking out? Yes. There we go. All right. And then... There's a lot of ships there. We're going to need a pretty big stack to free that. Guy. Repair. You. What are you? Not worth finding out. That's what you are. All right, you have an important job to do. You got to start taking out these Mitsukes, man. All right, can I leave now? Culture predicted... Um, wait a little bit longer. You keep destroying this. You keep destroying this. Damn it! That was a good ninja, too. Fuck. Alright, well, you head this way. Just keep it up. That was one of the good ninjas. That's a shame. Where can we send you? That's useful. You're kind of surrounded right here. Here you go. Get rid of that. Alright. Alright. That's so bad. Turn out ships. Oh, this navy got freed a little bit. Can you go do anything with that? Where are you? Go up. Uh, see if you can scare those guys away. Yeah, there, there we go. All right. Slowly but surely, get it, get in some ground back on the navy side of things. You go here. Look at that. Starting to get a decent amount of sword folks coming in here. And we got our good archers. 
All right, peace with the Atano. You hang out here. Um, I guess we already have... How many ninjas do we have over here? We got one down here, one up there. That's basically... I don't think it's worth recruiting a ninja up here. Eh, fuck it. Fuck it. All right. All right. We're doing good. Despite the way it appears, we are not doing too shabby. After one more turn, we should be able to head this way. It would be really nice if after we take this island, we could get peace with the chest of Kabe. That, that would be wonderful. all our good boats, but whatever, I guess. Hojo oh, cowards. What's the Hojo get a little weaker? I just can't believe the Decada haven't even taken them out yet. Like, they only have four provinces, and l most of them aren't even connected. It doesn't make any sense that they're even still alive. <laughs> like... How are they this bit annoying of a threat to me at this point? Ugh. Doesn't make any sense. All right, get knocked out, bro. Your Mitsuke are dead men. I'll treat from that. Dang, why is just so Kabe being so coy with their ship placement? It's because they're scared. They're scared. Boasting. What? That was a good monk. How the hell did he do that? Oh, you guys are so dead, bro. That was a good monk, too. That doesn't even make any fucking sense. Damn it. Alright, well, you fucking stay here. I'm coming for your ass, bro. Fuck you guys. You guys are so fucking dead. You don't even fucking understand. Who are you? Go get him. All right. Let's <sighs> just keep screwing these guys over. Alright. Alright, let's see. We need to repair you. that way for now. Keep churning out the boats. Keep churning them out. Churning them out. We cannot have enough. It's not even possible to have enough boats at this point. Keep them coming. Alright. 
I really cannot, I don't understand how the Hojo are holding out. I really, I really don't get it. Alright. Not the prettiest thing in the world, but we're doing it. It's almost like Realm Divide happened without it even happening, because I'm already at war with so many people's navies, which is by far the most annoying part of Realm Divide. At least it looks like a lot of the Hojo Fort guys are retreating at least. Should buy us some time. God, they're being annoying here. Look, these Mitsukes are out of control, bro. Like, fuck you. Like, fuck, like, what are you supposed to do about that? All right, I just can't have any agents on this island. Resolve. That's I hate naval combat, because now I gotta send my guy back to get repaired before I can even get him this far. It took long enough to get over there in the first place, now I gotta send him the whole way back. Naval combat's just so fucking stupid in this game. What? What's the point of even, like, doing it? It's not even- Realm Divide already happened without even happening. That's great. That's per fucking lovely, bro. All right, whatever. I'll take you all on. I don't give a shit. Y'all are fucking weak, anyways. Alrighty. Hey, look at this fucking mess. All these guys are at war with me, by the way. What are you supposed to do about this? You can't fucking do anything. I literally can't even fucking move. It's so stupid, bro. I hate the naval naval part of this game. It is so fucking dumb. It just totally takes away from to total wars about the land battles, and you can't even really have too many of them because you spend most of your money just trying to not get wrecked from the ocean. You can't even fucking cross over here. With all this shit. Fuck you guys. I am going to enjoy killing all of you. It is going to be great. Starting with y'all. Nice to finally left this one alone. Alright. Guess I'll send you this way. As much as it pains me. Need all the boats we can get at this point. Everyone hates me, bro. It's like Realm Divide happened without it even happening. It doesn't make any sense. I even got tea ceremony. 
Alright, whatever. I can take them. What the hell is this? Damn it. That's not what I meant to do. Sure, whatever. Alright, one less. And if Decatur can be at war with me if they want, as long as they don't send ships down here. Well, you have bigger problems. You're at war with the Oda, Takeda, right? They can't even deal with the Hojo. They've been at war with the Hojo for fucking ever. I'm at war with the Hojo, but instead of, like, uniting with me against them, they decide to declare war on me, too. There isn't even anything down here that they could possibly want. Doesn't make any sense. Alright, thank you, pirates, for helping me once. Where? Oh, fuck y'all, bro. Y'all are so fucking dead. I didn't even have an agent over here. Wouldn't make any sense. How is it like a victory if I'm the only one that loses a ship? Would they take peace with me yet? Come on, Chesokabe. Alright, they would. Alright, I gotta do it. Just cause, uh... I want to take this one, but they're, they're about to land a landing force. I gotta take peace with them now. There isn't anything here worthwhile. I gotta take peace with them now. Just to give my navy a break here. Would you pay me for peace? For my soul they would. Alright. You, you gotta pay. If you pay me, I will leave you the fuck alone. Bam. Alright. There we go. And just like that. We have found peace. So I'll just spy that we're there if you please. Alright, now we're only at war with these guys. Now we can start kicking some fucking ass. Get fuck you go oh you don't have the Chesokabe navies to help you out anymore, do you, Hojo? 
Do you? Oh, that's so sad. What are you gonna do now without your fucking... What are you gonna do now that you don't have the freaking Chesso Kabe to hold your hands through everything anymore? Oh, that sucks for you, Hojo. Too bad, that's a shame. And you, Oda. You guys are still actually kind of strong. I need to take my time with you. But don't worry, Oda. Your day will come. Alright, and then come here, repair, now that I don't have to worry about the Chesokabe anymore, once these guys are all repaired up, I can come take this from the Hojo again. Alright. Nice. Right, we didn't take all the island, but I kind of really needed a piece of the Chesso copy just because the, the naval situation was really starting to get out of hand. So now this buys us a little time. We can breathe a little easier. Start building our forces, getting our, our, our Doom stacks, our endgame stacks ready. Sun, we got our Sun right here. He's going to have his own army. We're going to keep this stack here for a while. <laughs> Alright, well now this, this requires a fair bit of re-strategizing now. It's time we're going to have to switch things up a bit here. So, just made peace with the Chesso Kabe. It's time to take our breath and get ready for the final push. Some things we got to do, just right out the gate. Um, got to take this trade node back from the Hojo. Got to get our navies all reconfigured so they're we're back and controlling our own waters again. And we got to get our doom stacks here ready. I'm just going to leave this stack here. I'll probably just leave it like this. But over here, we're going to have to start phasing out the Ashigaru and just get Katana and Bow Warrior Monk stacks ready. One here, one here, and then eventually for the late, late game, for the, for the final real push, we're going to push out here. Once we reach around here, we'll probably should phase this guy out too, and then we'll because we'll need three stacks at least to get the whole way through all of this. But for now, that should work for now, just fine. Oda, why are you being such dicks to me? Speak if you must, but speak. You yeah, literally have so many enemies, your and lots of them are right next to you. I guess they're allies with the Chesokabe. What about you, Takeda? I guess just they've declared war on me because they're allies with the Oda. I do not wish to listen. Damn. Alright, well yeah. It's time just to do a little bit of regrouping, I think. Um So we probably won't get to another battle this episode. It's a shame we never even did like a real live action in person battle this whole episode which is a shame but that's just sort of the way it goes with total war and this like sort of middle game that you get into so it's probably gonna be like maybe one more episode of getting ready but probably two episodes from now we'll be ready to initiate realm divide and go for the final push to take over all of japan here what we just made peace. Y'all just paid me a bunch of money for it. Fuck you. You guys are so dead. I cannot wait. I cannot wait, Chesoka, man. You guys are so dead. You guys are so fucking dead. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, you guys. You have no idea. Where? Where are y'all landing? Oh, that's cute.
You don't even know how dead you guys are. You guys don't even know. Alright. Well, let's take these guys out. Take them out one at a time here. It's a lot of captured units. Hell yeah. Oh, they got, oh yeah, let's take that out too while we're at it. Y'all are regretting redeclaring war on me now, aren't you? Aren't you? Yeah, stupid Cheso Kabe. Screw you guys, man. I tried to make peace with you. I really wanted it to work. Just a shame is all. things up a little bit here now. Here you guys. You guys hang out right here. You guys do your thing. What are you? Are you all powerful? Probably regroup over here. You should get repaired as soon as you can. You're getting repaired. You can link up with this one. Whatever. Whatever, man. Might as well try to take this guy out, too. Damn it. No matter. Chesso Kabe didn't keep their end of the bargain for very long. That ain't nice of them at all, man. So I got a bit of a stuffy nose. All right. But the good news is that these guys are getting pretty... I've actually, I'm starting to regain control of the seas a little bit here. Which is the good news. That is the good news. Alright. Well, this is a pretty wild episode. We went from war to peace to back to war. We might actually get to do one actual battle here, though. Because I think the Chesokabe are going to try to take this castle from me and fail miserably. 
which of course, you know, they would. They stand no real chance against me. Let's retreat a little bit here. Ah, you want y'all want peace? I'd like that. I'd like that, Oda. I can respect you, Oda. Yeah, that... I'm glad. I'm glad to hear that, Oda. I respect y'all. Y'all are the people, the peasants. Like y'all are a pretty cool clan. Oda Nambanuga, whatever his name is. I think that was the guy that actually won this war in real life. Oh. All right, Chesokabe. Hojo are kind of pulling back. The Oda aren't fighting me anymore. It's just mano a mano, you versus me. I don't think you want to be in that situation. Apparently, I just completely forgot about this one, I guess. All right, well, you're not really needed over here anymore, so you should get over here. Sight. Whatever. Are y'all not gonna attack me? Oh, you're scared. You don't want. You don't want to attack me. Well, I might attack you. So how do you feel about that? Oh uh, yeah, I am going to do one battle, and it, it is just going to be absolutely butchering these guys. So y'all have that to look forward to. Sokabe, what happened? What happened to all your friends that were willing to fight me with you? Where'd they go? That's what I thought. There we go. Alright. You're a good Navy. You come back here. You join up with these guys. You come here to repair yourself. Wait. You don't need to be repaired that badly. Eh, might as well. Alright, alright. Y'all get one real battle here. Because I'm going to enjoy... I'm just... I'm going to enjoy smack destroying these guys. What can I say? I'm looking forward to it. What do they got? got nothing I need to worry about. Let's do a battle on the battlefield. They ain't even got a general. I know this is not the best strategy ever to just attack, but this is like my kind of fodder army anyways, because I'm going to be phasing these guys out for samurai. It's just all Yari Ashigaru, so 
As long as I don't lose, I don't mind winning empirically to make this video more entertaining, if that's what it takes. Do, 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 do. All right, here we are. So game, how do you have them lined up? You have these guys. We want, we're gonna want these guys like this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So we want one, two, three, four, five, six on the left, six on the right. Bow guys like that. You two like this. See what they do. They're gonna just go straight for this hill, probably. That's what I would do. So. We are going to four, five, six. Just set up right outside of their archer's range and then try to bait their archers down if we can. Oh, yeah, they got their bow. Chest of Kabe Bow Shigaru. They do have better bow than me. So, honestly, we should just bum rush them. It's the actual strategy we should go for. We'll just slowly inch our way up until we find the proper bum rushing distance. And we can probably sacrifice our bow at Shigaru so that the, hopefully their bow units focus on them. And we can... Like, where are they going? What are y'all doing? Like, are they in Yari Wall? I can't tell. Alright. Inch these guys up a little bit further. Inch the line up right behind them a little bit further. Huh. The Katana Samurai are ahead of their archers, so we might actually be able to just focus them without boat guys going for us. Alright, time to run you guys up. Walk up right here. Alright. There we go. You guys hold right here. You guys hold right here. Ah. Let's hang out. Hold right here. Whole line, reorganize here, and just attack them. Just go for them. You guys hang out right here. Just go at them. Just hang out like that. 
I'll go up here. I'll tag, and y'all go forward like this. Honestly, y'all can just sort of sit in the Yari wall now and just wait for them to charge you. And now that it looks like everything's going to be aight, we put y'all like this. Y'all charge them in the back right here. And y'all set up like this. Jeez, it's like a whole thing. Alright. Now they should surrender relatively quickly right over there. Alright, time to put you in stand and fight. And you guys just fire at will at whatever you want. Look at them go here, heck yeah. You guys gotta protect our general though. And you guys gotta do the same, so. Look at that. Get him. Nice. There y'all go. That'll help defend my general a little bit. He's my son and heir. I don't want him to die. That'd be bad. Look at that. And then they're, they're breaking over here. All right. We got to get the outro clip moment right here. That's right. Run away, cowards. Nice. All right, well, I at least got one battle in for y'all. One real battle. Probably going to call the episode right here. Nice. Hey, look, they still survived, kind of. I'm going to auto-resolve this one. Just... There we go. All right. Look at that. All right, probably going to call it here. We're at peace with the Oda. We're only really at war with these three. The Takeda don't... I mean, now that we're not at war with the Oda, maybe we could make peace with the Takeda. No? You are here. Well, eventually, maybe we could. But, yeah. We're going to call it here. This was a good episode, guys. We took most of this island. We'll probably take Oahe on the next turn, or the next uh, playthrough pretty early on. And most importantly is we're starting to regain control of the seas a little bit. It may not look like it since we lost a trade note to the Hojo, but with only really the Chesokabe's navies to deal with, I feel like the Hojo threw everything they had at us, and now they've lost it. Uh, the Oda gave up. They uh, made peace with us. So they were probably the strongest clan we were at war with. And now we don't have to worry about them. Which is good. And the uh, Chesokabe are getting pretty decimated here. I think we honestly could make peace with them again if we wanted. But I'm not sure if we do want to. I don't know. I think I'd like to take Oahe first and then make peace with them. But, well, that will probably be in the next episode. But thanks for watching, guys. Uh, I'll probably have a true crime video coming out this week. That will actually probably come out before this episode does. So just let me know what y'all think of that and any other content you'd like to see on this channel. And thanks for watching, guys. I, I do really appreciate it. So I'll see y'all in the next episode. Bye-bye.